Titan, moon of Saturn. It is a place of vast lakes, seas and rivers that are made out of liquid methane and ethane. It also has a thick atmosphere, 1.5 times thicker than our own on Earth. So then what if this very lively looking place were to become our moon? So let's say for some reason something caused it to escape from Saturn's gravity and it started drifting towards the Earth. This means that Titan would get closer to the Sun which would cause for some serious changes on Titan. So on Titan's way to here, the temperature at one point would rise enough to make the methane in the lakes of Titan to evaporate, leaving ethane, because ethane has a lower boiling point. But eventually, the temperature will also cause for ethane to evaporate, leaving no methane and ethane liquids on the surface of Titan. All those seas and rivers would be just gone, but they would leave a mark on Titan with lake basins. But the temperature could also create new liquid water lakes through the heating of water ice on its surface. Other ices that are present on its surface could also melt, creating larger liquid oceans. So then Titan comes to Earth, and this is when unpredictable things would happen. Because Titan could also crash into the Earth, and it may not even settle into orbit, because even though the moon Luna is smaller than Titan, it has a higher surface gravity than Titan. So really, Moon would likely be stable, but it is uncertain for Titan. But let's say it somehow settles into orbit at around 500,000 kilometers of a distance. From Earth, Titan would appear a bit bigger than the Moon, and it would look very hazy. Titan would also reflect light and be a bit brighter than the Moon, which would turn night landscapes on Earth lightly yellow. Titan and the Moon would also create very large tides and waves when they combine which would make coastal regions on Earth less safe. But besides that, Titan itself would also experience a lot more changes. Not only would the lakes be gone, but it would even impact the atmosphere. So because the temperature will rise on Titan a lot, likely similar to Earth, it would cause the atmosphere to escape bit by bit over time. Now that is because when air molecules are heated, they are more active and thus more likely to escape from any celestial object in turn causing whole atmospheres to be stripped out. But still, that would happen very slowly over time on Titan, and it would never fully strip out the atmosphere. Still, it would not be such a hazy and cloudy world as it is now when it is cold. But it's not that Titan would be just this pretty object going around the Earth. It would actually be one of the best places in the whole solar system to colonize, with not that much effort. So the evidence through Titan's wobbly surface shows that it has a liquid ocean underneath the surface, which could be used to create a new atmosphere, which in turn would create a pretty nice place to settle in for a while. But it would look a lot different from the original Titan, since even color of the atmosphere could change that. Plus, it is more likely that, as said, water ice on its surface would melt, creating water lakes, and other ices on Titan could melt creating even larger bodies of liquid. Communication would not be such a problem as well since Earth and Titan would be so close. But despite that fact, Titan would become a lot different from its landscape to its atmosphere. It would change. So all in all, if Titan were to become our moon, it would be quite a good thing. We humans would have a nice place to permanently live on. It would be like a whole new world that would just remind us of Titan.